Brandon Brunson back with you, joined by Coach Mike Robles, head coach of Middle Christian Mustangs. We're talking a little bit about the seniors tonight. Mm -hmm. So, nice way to go out with the seniors tonight. 12 2 win over a good crane going crane program. Right, yeah. So, yeah, talk a little bit about that. No, it, it was good to, good for them. It, it, it really was, you know. Um, they, they worked, definitely worked all year, worked on all four years for it, and I'm glad that they could go out on that note. Um, you know, obviously, we would like to have a better season in general for them, but you know what? They, they got out here and then they got the big win at the end of the day. And that was that was really good to see and I'm, I'm happy for them. Yeah, so talk about the leadership. Is there some leadership you're going to miss next year and some guys have to step up and fill some voids, I would assume, for some of those guys? Absolutely. All, all four of those guys, they're, they're all really, really, really good kids. And um, they're, they're just great people. They're they're fun to be around. I told um, I told the guys before the year started, that, well, not before the year started, as we were going, that, that it was a, a fun group, and, and those seniors were a big part of it, and um, they, they just really were. I know, like, for example, Zach Rietz, like that kid yeah. never does not smile. He has a <laughs> smile on his face all the time, all the time. Jake, um, he's, uh, <laughs> Jake's from, he's kind of like our little surfer dude, porter <laughs> kind of, you know, yeah. like cool man, like that kind of guy. <laughs> and so he was always, he was always being goofy. D, you know, he's just, Awesome kid. He came to us from Lee, and um, you know, he got got an opportunity over here and took advantage of it. And he's played with a lot of our guys uh, growing up, and and he was always just like a great kid to be around. And then of course you have Nate Dog. Um, you know, he's he loves being around people. He, he likes uh, likes all the camaraderie. He loves loves getting to swing the bat as you can yes, tell. He, did. <laughs> he he did not sell himself short one bit. <laughs> he he left it all out there on the field. And, that was awesome, and then uh, of course uh, Sammy Leva. Um, he came over to us from Permian. Unfortunately, you know, due to the transfer rule, he couldn't play on varsity. But um, you know, he came over and he was a hard worker. And got after him. He was a good ball player, and so um, really expect to see some of those or see all those guys succeed in life. You know, and then at the yep. end of the day, that's what it's all about. Sure. You know, um, I don't know if they're gonna go and remember their their high school career or anything like that, but I'm hoping that they learn some lessons from each other, just the type of kids they are. And that was, that's what I'm doing. Chemistry is always an interesting thing, Coach, and I remember that from my days. Year to year, you just never know what you might miss. So you might get into next year, oh, that's what you brought to us. Mm -hmm. That's what we missed. But some good performances tonight yeah. uh, from some of your seniors. Uh, so Daniel Sanchez, two for three. A couple of RBIs, yeah, yeah. so he did a good job. Uh, Jake Richardson, two for three, scored four runs. So he was all over the place. <laughs> he loved it. Yeah, so those some good got some pop. It was weird because we were taking BP. You know, they take BP all all, uh, all through the, the week and everything. You know. And it was, seriously, this last week and a half, it's like he kind of got some man strength and he started hitting the ball further and further. So <laughs> whenever he burned the guy, I was like, whoa, there it is. That was nice. Right over <laughs> center field. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, that was one we thought. He settled under. No, he's not. It's gone. Yeah. So uh, did, did a really nice job there. I did know, so you mentioned Sammy. Uh, I saw him doing some nice back flips. Yeah. Here, so. Even though he couldn't play, he was still engaged and involved yes. in keeping the team loose. So yes. it's such an important thing for, mm -hmm. for kids that, that may not be able to, but just to keep the good attitude and keep, keep yeah. going. For sure. Because, you know, I mean, and like I was saying, you know, it's at the end of the day, it's it's how are they going to be whenever they leave this place? What, what are they going to be like? Um, are they going to su succeed in life, you know, as a father, as a husband? And that, you know, and that's ultimately the big picture. That's the important thing. And um, so I, I hope that those guys kind of think of it. Yeah. And really, Coach, you mentioned it, not the season you would like, but I don't think that that isn't the last thing. So they remember last year in the playoffs, and they remember tonight and the good things that you guys did and the coaching that they received. And just as you said, you're building fathers and husbands and, and, and men in our society so much. So appreciate your hard work with all those yeah, guys. for sure. And we are looking forward a little bit to next season. <laughs> yeah, for sure. And I really hope those guys will come back. Uh, it's always fun to see guys that you coach come back or see them get married, I think, this last summer. So Tidwell, Brandon Tidwell. Nice. Got to go to his wedding. And, and that was, so that's always a treat. That's, yep. that's something I heard it somewhere is it's not, you know, at the end of the day with the kids and everything, it's, you know, what makes you a great coach. It's not the wins and losses. It's, you know, what coach, it, it leads me. That's what I look forward to is how many wedding invites can I get? Absolutely. Like, like, do we 
get some wedding advice, it would be, be great, you know, because then you kind of, kind of makes you feel good at the end of the day that you had a positive impact on, not just in the game. And so it absolutely does. So I haven't coached in a very long time, but I have kids that I coached in 1993 and 94 that still on Facebook, hey coach, or when they see me, hey coach, and there's just something really deep down that kind of hits me about, it didn't matter what we did, I remember some of the nice games, but right. it's about building the character. And that's what you're doing. Uh, and it's obvious, so we appreciate what you do. Keep building into those young men, and we're excited to see what those guys do in the future and, and what that young class steps into. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So congratulations. Thank You're you. done. You can take a breath now <laughs> and get ready season. for it's golf, it's season. golf season. And golf. Soon. The weather was beautiful. But today. before you know it, Coach, it's football, it's football season. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Absolutely. Appreciate you, Coach. Absolutely. We'll Thank see you. you next season. Thank right, you so much good. for joining us. Sir.